okay, parents, the kids are going to be out of school until May the 1st. That's what they said. But I, I want to keep our kids active. Um, actually, our kids are supposed to be active at least an hour a day, seven days a week. But I know that's not possible. So what we're going to do, or what I want our students to do, I want them to be active three days a week. And how we're going to do that, I'm going to set up a YouTube channel. And I'm going to show them some exercises. And I want them to uh, go to my website on YouTube and just let me know they exercise at least three times a week. That way I can stay in touch with them, they can stay in touch with me. I am actually going to give you the YouTube website tomorrow. But today, um, all of my students know exactly what to do. The first 10 minutes is a warm up. I got my son Jordan here and he's going to help us out. So um, with the warm up and all my kindergartens, first grade, second, third, fourth, and fifth grade, everyone knows the warm up. It takes about 10 minutes to get through it. And so the kids will be uh, actually be able to tell you parents what to do. So Jordan, um, what we do parents, we always start off with a neck row. And the kids know exactly what to do. Tell us nice and loose. Then I'll say reverse. Then after we reverse, the kids reverse. Next exercise is, are the arm rolls. So they're going to go forward until larger. And I'm going to go kind of fast because this is just redundant. And then stop Jordan. And then we're going to go backwards um, just to loosen up the arms. Next, we got something called waybacks. And the way that we do our waybacks are you're going to touch your toes, touch your knees, and lean back. But there's a way that you'll hear my students count, and they're going to go one, two, way back, two, two, way back, all the way to ten, two, way back. And so, and the last thing while you're standing up is something that's called a squat thrust. Now, the way that you do a squat thrust is you bend down, you kick your feet out, come in and up. And like I said, all the students know how to do this. That's called a squat thrust. So again, while you are standing up, a warm up is neck rows, arm rows, way backs, squat thrust. And then you're gonna sit down. Once you sit down, now you're gonna actually uh, loosen up the bottom. So you got something called butterfly. You just take your knees and loosen up your hamstring. The kids know exactly what to do. After that, you got your leg stretches. You're gonna um, count to 10, do your left right and middle. After that, that's when they do their sit-ups and the kids know to put their hands on their chest because that's the best way to do your sit-ups. So you're going to lean back, come up doing your sit-ups. They do two of them. Also, then they're going to do their push-ups. When they do their push-ups, they do 10 push-ups. After 10 push-ups, they just do their jumping jacks. We're going to do 10, but they have a special way of doing their jumping jacks. And they'll show you, you do five, 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 five. That's just our method at school, and, it, and you'll love it when the kids show you that. Um, finally, to stay busy, what I do, I just walk my neighborhood for one hour. I don't even want them to be busy for one hour. Let's start out um, real simple this week. Let's have the kids exercise three times this week for 30 minutes. That's all I'm asking. And then at the end of the week, they'll go to YouTube, look at my website, say, Mr. Smith, I did it, yes or no. That's what I want. I just want to find a way to see who's exercising, see who's staying busy. The thing is, you just don't want your kid to stay in the house and not do anything. Let them go out and play. Going out and play will work. If you just let them go out and play for 30, 40, 50, an hour, that would be great. But they have to stay busy. Don't just let them sit in the house and play on the game. So tomorrow, again, I will give you my YouTube website so all the kids can follow me. So I hope this is going to be a way to keep our kids up and exercising. Thank you, parents.